you know, it just occurred to me that that was a that that was a sound clown of uh, a bit trip runner song. So that's not bad. That's pretty. That's pretty decent. Uh, so we've done uh, some quake and uh, fuck. We've done some quake. We've done some democracy. I think now is time for a bit of relaxation in Terraria. Uh, it's going to be nothing, you know, majorly uh, impressive going on this time. Uh, I'm not planning on making too much progress. This stream is meant to be intended as a, uh, it's sort of like a companion piece to the other stream. Basically, what I'm hoping to do in this is uh, do shit that you know, people who are watching Terraria for the progress would find boring. So, you know, uh, oh, you want to build a house? That's, that's fucking dumb. You know, why would you do that? You should go off and fight the Eye of Cthulhu and all that shit. You know, so, my aim is to be building houses and making them look all nice and fancy in these streams and then going off and actually progressing through the game on Fridays. That's how I pitched it. And that's how it's going to be done. Now, while it's while it's uh, taking its time loading up, I'm going to have some Pringles. Or oh, bits of Pringles. Mm. Those are some good Pringles. there in the background. It's telling me to try Edge of Space, which is funny. Right. Now, I did notice something with the volume last time, in that it wasn't very loud, so we're going to put it up a bit and see what happens. Time to play. Streamland. get inside the house. <clears throat> Hello Brett. What's happening? What's chilling? Let's see, what's my uh, my strats on things? My strats and stats. They're alright, they're middling. Uh, Ooh, I've lost a lot of my money though. So I did have a gold piece last stream. I remember that distinctively. So the aims that I've got right now is to make a nice little settlement for the merchant and for anyone else who wants to move in, I guess. Let's see, would I get anything else? I'm not sure, really. We're going to make we're going to make some buildings today. We're going to make some houses, which hopefully will help with NPCs moving in at some point in the future. That is the aim for today, and I hope that it will uh, it will work out that way. Let's go for that one as well. Yeah, there we go. Mm -hmm. Now we can put down a foundation. Thank you. Okay. 
me, uh, there we go. There we go. Just build a nice little uh, settlement. Bench for him, like so. Oh wait, can I make a mana crystal? I didn't know that. I thought you needed ten. You know, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. That is, uh, that's some good stuff. Cause it means I don't have to worry about. Well, really about collecting uh, mana crystals for a while. I mean, I don't need to anyway, I haven't got any mana weapons yet, but this will be a useful thing for the future. Um, make ourselves a nice wood wall. So, would this be suitable housing? This would indeed be suitable housing, nice. So now, I can get back to uh, the important task at hand, and that is killing slimes. And getting some organisation done. Oh, Nick, you don't know anything about Terraria? Welcome to, uh, welcome to the fun stream, my friend. Today is a day of, of learning, of discoverment, the discovery of merriment. You're going to love what you see. Hmm. Right. Let's just quick stack these real quick. Huh? Quick. Um. In bars. I think something that would be very helpful is if uh, there was a way of of using both copper and tin at the same time as things. That would be very helpful indeed. No, it looks like I can't make anything. Which is a bit of a shame, really. All right, back into the chest you go. Douche, 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 douche. Need to get a few more chests, I think. Um, Terraria is very much like a, you know, the, a lot of people describe it as it's like Minecraft, but it really isn't. The similarities it shares with Minecraft is you start off in a world and you have to explore the world uh, to find resources and survive and everything, but Terraria has a lot more in common with RPGs and Metroidvanias. Um, you have to build up a town with NPCs and everything. Uh, you gradually get weapons which will upgrade and improve your uh, abilities and everything. It's quite... I feel like, as a game, it has more depth. Whereas Minecraft, I always see as my own like personal set of Legos. Uh, with Terraria, I, I quite often really feel that it's... Uh, you know, there's a lot more to it than just, you know, oh, hey, it's Legos, guys. Hey, look, I built a house with these Legos, guys. Put 
this up here then. And then go here. Ah, nice. Got some tin. Yeah. Welcome back, Ashley. You've come back just in time to scrutinise me uh, as to how I play Terraria and build my houses. I'm sure you're you're more than thrilled to uh, to do that. Right now, the fun part of uh, finally having a map in this. Hey, more tin ore, nice. Fun part of this. Come back, come on, come on, fight me! Fight me, worm! I will... Yeah. Yeah, that's what you get. One couldn't mess with me. Oh, God. Yes, boy! Alright, cool. Let's get going this way. Now, as far as I know, uh, when you leave the game, entities unload. So, my money is gone from last time, which I'm quite sad about. But hey-ho. Here. Aha, get fucked, slimes. I'm gonna shoot at you. I'm nothing if not a bad shot. Oh my god. No. Nothing to do with that. Oh god. Right. First order of business. We're getting rid of you. Little shit. Uh, I think. I think I'm gonna mine it upwards. That thing, because I, I don't want to deal with the uh, the collective shit of all the, the fucking rock traps and bollocks that was that was all around it before. Fuck off. Oh my god! And I can't take another potion just yet. Lovely. Terraria has sort of a, a slow curve at the start in the game. You you're a bit you're a bit fucked uh, off like that until you actually realise how to play the game properly and how to get all of the items and everything. You're not really given much explanation as to what to do either, which doesn't really help. Oh, you want to see? Do you, do you want to see my my hard world mode, uh, hard mode world even, hard hard world mode? I can do that. I I have no objections to it. I will show you at the end of the stream. Oh, there we go. Lovely stuff. Lovely stuff. Oh, nice, okay, it's it's just... Let's get rid of that. Let's put that there. Oh, more water! Okay, nice. 
Oh, that doesn't really seem to be affected much, does it? Oh, right. oh but this will. Oh! <laughs> nice job. All right. I'll just wait for um that to clear out. Let me just have a few Pringles. Oh, right. God, I wonder what it's doing it in the bottom of that cave. Alright, that seems strange. Hmm. Cool, cool. Let's get to it. You know... This game is one of those games where it's like, you can look back at the development of it, the development history, and just be truly amazed at how far it's come. Since release, that is. Like, it's, it's insane. It is truly insane how far this game has come, uh, you know, in the, in the amount of time that it has been out. I'm just going to take this life crystal. Now, one of the uh, the more Metroid aspects of the game is items that allow you to increase your life and your mana, like that, for example. So I've just picked that up. I'm now manaed up. It's all good. Oh, can I actually get out? No, I can't. And now I'm going to be butt fucked by this guy. Except not. Right. Oh, is that more tin? That is. No, no, I think that's iron, isn't it? Is it iron? I can't remember. Yeah, that's iron. Alright, let's go get some more iron. Let's do that. Lovely stuff. Right, now see, up there. That's the fucking. It's the really shitty area of the, the game. Excuse me. I'm gonna have to wait for a second for them to come up here. I will need to do something about that. Just realised how close it got. Yeah, no, stay away, please. Alright, lovely stuff. Let's go down. Get rid of that, get rid of that, get rid of that. I nearly had a fucking heart attack there for a second. I totally already knew what it was going to do as well. Oh, hello. Hello, beauty. That's some platinum ore, yes, 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 yes. Get away from my platinum ore. You too. You too. Get out get out. Thank you. God. The nerve some people. I'm trying to take my glorious ores. Um now I'm not I'm not entirely sure yet what I'm gonna do in regards to uh, this series. I might, if people think it's a good idea, uh, open it up, make it a multiplayer thing. See, the thing is, I've never really been that much of a, a multiplayer Terraria guy. I don't find it all that enjoyable myself to play multiplayer. Don't know why. I've just never really seen much of an appeal to it. So. That's partially why it was never a multiplayer game to begin with. However, if people feel like it would be better that way, you know, maybe the progression would get done quicker or that, then I can totally see why uh, why you would want that, and I would be willing to go ahead with that as well. So, your choice really. Um, whatever you think, uh, I will go with.
I get rid of that. Don't need to get up here. Iron ore is always good. Iron ore is like the only ore in the game. Uh, once you get past like platinum, that is, it, or platinum and gold, which is actually still useful. It's the only tier ore that does that. Oh, and there is some more. Every little bit counts. Get out of here. So get out of here. Thank you. Oh, there's another crystal! Hey, Nice! Hold on a second. What? Please don't. Really? Are we in the jungle? I mean, that's not... That's not good. So how close is the jungle to the spawn? No, no, that can't be. Surely. Oh god, it is. This is the jungle. Why the hell? Why is there jungle here? I don't, I don't get it. Why? Does that mean... If I go too far to the left, then the jungle will just be, like, everywhere. That's fucking weird. Alright, well. Okay, well, time to tame fate. Because the jungle is very much a place that you shouldn't be when you're early level. That's not a smart idea. So I'm... Oh, fuck. It's one of those guys. And that is exactly why, because you get fuckers like this. See? Look how much... Oh, my God. Fuck, I need to go. I need to go. I'm going to have to... The longer you stay in there, the longer you risk having to deal with these fucks. Look, full damage. I can't, I can't go up there yet. There's no way I can go anywhere near that area yet. That is so fucking weird. Yep. Yep, that's actually one of the best ways to uh, make sure that you, you still have money. Right, prequel potion time. A bit upsetting, to be honest. I haven't really found much in terms of uh, chests, because you normally find an abundance of the bloody things. Like, you can't get enough of them. Right. Let's build some shit. Gonna smelt a bunch of a uh, bunch of bars. That's what I'm gonna do, and it's gonna be great. So four platinum bars. That's that's good. That's a good start. Tungsten. Five tungsten bars. How many iron? Come on, fingers. Six. Well, I mean, you know, it's better than nothing, I guess. Tin bars. Oh, there we go. We fit the gold mine there. Right. Now let's. Well, 
We're going to have to make a helmet. Uh, I'm still going to keep the goggles on. What I've done there is, right, th this is like a vanity slot over here to the side. Um, so I'm putting them in there. Still technically got the tin helmet on. So, it's all still very much... Oh, fuck off. F off, zombie. There we go. Right, going to pick this up real quick. And then... Oh my god, how many zombies? Jesus Christ, look at all these guys. Fucking hell. That's a lot of zombies. Oh. I actually forgot that quite a lot of your, uh, your, your gold will come from killing zombies at night time. It's just, that's just a fact. There are a lot of these guys. Let's pull these back down here. Let's use that. Uh, archery potion. Don't need that really. Mm. Don't need a dart trap, I don't think. I don't believe it's necessary. Should be a. No? Alright. Hey, look. There's another star for me to add to my collection. Let's go get it. Wait, what? Where'd it go? Oh, it's daytime, isn't it? Oh my god! All right. All right. Just gonna go out and explore a bit on this side. Because apart from anything, I want to confirm my suspicions that the jungle is like right fucking next to me. On the left. Which, if it is, is not really that good of a sign, to be honest. Um, that means a large majority of the world is cut off to me until I've uh, gone through the corruption. Oh, no, no, okay, the corruption is like right fucking there on this side as well. I'm not going to deal with you either, mister. I'm a oh, fuck. <laughs> the, the corruption is not a fun thing to deal with early game. It's not, it's, it's extremely powerful. It's very deadly. It will hurt you a lot, physically and mentally. Um, overall, yes, yeah, it's, it's not. It's not a fun place. All right. Let's just check the map real quick. This is this is the map. We're consulting the map. So that down there is jungle. Why it's jungle? I have no bloody idea. But. There we go. Um, ideally, we really need some more chests, and I'm kind of shafted in which ways I can go, because there seems to be corruption on both sides of the area, so we're kind of stuck with this tiny little plot of land that we have here, and that's it. Uh, I can confirm that, I think, just by going across this small little bit of river. That corruption over? Yes, it is. Bloody hell! Oh my god, he's coming for me. Not that I particularly think he's a threat right now. Like well, they're only a threat if you don't know how to deal with them. But it still is not particularly. I do, however, need to get out of the corruption as soon as possible so that they don't, you know, start spawning fucking millions of the things. Oh, 
like four of them. That that could very much, you know, probably hurt my uh, my ability to actually do things. I'm gonna have to funnel them. This is the kind of uh, high quality, high class entertainment that you were waiting for when you decided, hey look, let's watch a stream with, with Jason. Oh look, he's hiding in a hole and he's he's not letting enemies attack him, lovely. Let's see if that does anything. Now I'm getting ganged from all directions, fucking fantastic. Okay, there's one. You can fuck off and all. You are a little shit. Okay, so, good thing to note, we are fucked in both directions. Can't go over there, because that is most certainly the corruption. Can't go over there, because that is also most certainly the corruption. Um, so the only place to go right now is down, and we need to keep on going down until, really, ideally, we have enough resources to be able to go left or right. We're also kind of impeded in how far we can go down, thanks to, um, well, thanks to the, 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 the fucking, uh, th thanks to the amount of fucking stuff that we have. It's, it's great. It's a great dilemma that we have right here. Is that a bit of tin? That's a bit of tin. It's a great dilemma that we have, that we're currently shafted on basically all, in all directions. Um, and the only way we can go is kind of just we just got to kind of avoid the jungle and I hope we don't end up going too far into it we need to get some ore obviously that is important but Here's an idea. Let's see what's up here. Nothing. Nothing be important. Okay, nice. I mean that's a tiny bit of iron, but oh no, that's a bigger bit of iron. That's that's worth mining through. Yes, it is. Go fuck yourself. Fucking bell end of a dart trap. <sighs> I've not enjoyed that dart trap for years. It is. It has bested me for years, but now, now I've got the upper fucking hand because I'm around. I'm still around, and the dart trap isn't. The dart trap can get fucked. Oh my god. Right. Just need to get some of this juicy iron. 
over here. I'm not actually sure if iron is juicy. Can't really comment on that. Um, but don't, you know, just don't take my word for it, basically. Just do that. Again, a very useful feature added in by uh, by an update. You don't want to have to, don't have to uh, individually mine each block. And I mean, I wouldn't blame you, but you don't want to do it. Well, that's fine. Just just let the game do it for you. And this is where you break through, and water drains. It's a jellyfish, nice. Actually, I should kill jellyfish, they give me glow sticks. And yes, you should try that in real life, that will work. It's not it's not it's not a joke. It actually works. Die jellyfish. Yes, boy, you've got glow sticks. So now, now if I need a light in the water, I can actually see, and it's such it's such a beautiful thing. Right. So I think. I think we're going to benefit by continuously mining in this direction. It's away from the jungle. It's hopefully away from the corruption. Got nothing to worry about, you know? Hopefully nothing to worry about. So, I think it is very much beneficial if we go in this way. Oh, God. However, I don't want to go in... Um, Unprepared. Here. Lovely stuff. Let's get rid of that. There we go. So that's all good. Um, we'll just do that. And nice. What? Well, what's going on here? Oh, for fuck's sake. Corruption's right there. Oh, lovely. So, we are basically fucked, no matter which way we go. So, let me see, right, so that's, that's the corruption. Oh, well, I mean, it is basically pretty much right oh my god we are right under there which makes me think that if we go too far over here then it's going to start spawning corruption enemies right 
was that? That was a yellow slime. Okay, that's it's not too big of a worry. However, this whole area doesn't really give me uh, very good vibes. So, you know what? I'm going to leave it alone. We're going to go down a bit more. I'm going to start digging there. Look at all those slimes. Oh, they found me. There we go. Alright, we're in the clear, guys. Now we've just got to... Just got to get around this. Uh, I'm going to get some more glow sticks. How are you going to get some more glow sticks, Jason? Gee, I don't know. There isn't any possible way that that could happen. Jason, that's animal cruelty. Yeah, well, you know, animals aren't exactly very nice to me. If they ain't gonna be nice to me, then I'm not gonna be nice to them back. You know, this is like a give-take relationship. It's an I take, and they're supposed to give a lot. But they don't normally do that. They're not very nice in that respect, so you know. That's where the problems arise. They don't they don't ever want to give. So I just tend to take. And open the floodgates. Oh. Just watch that. Destroy every single bloody to oh, fuck. Right, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna wall up this area. Because it's not it's not good. No, that's not what I wanted. I want you to Because I won't be able to enter that yet. Probably let the uh, the water fill that area, to be honest. Oh, fuck. Fuck off. You fucking bullshit jungle bat shit. you up there, lovely. Good lord, how much water is there? We are right at the... oh god. Come 
have a gun. Right. Now I should be able to come over here with little worry. That that is the theory, at least. I'm more than certain that it won't end up, you know, working out in practice, but hey ho, that's 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 how it goes. So Let's go up here. Let's grab myself some uh, some lovely jubbly tin ore. Nice stuff. Oh. That would help. time are we looking at? Okay, we, we've been going for about an hour then. Nice stuff. Uh, I think we do just a bit more spelunking. And then to end the stream I'll show off my fancy uh, 1.3 completed world or halfway completed world because I never complete worlds. That's an opening. Breaking through, boys. Oh. Oh, look at that. Oh, that is some iron that I can get behind right there. Oh. Give me some of that. There we go. Oh, there we go. Alright. Uh, this, 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 and this. That's water. It's a lot of water. Let's explore, guys. Let's see what's under there. Mm, is that copper? No, that's iron. Why does it look so different? Oh, that's weird. Things looking just a bit better now. And um, by better, I mean you can actually see what's going on. That's always good. Come on. There we go. Did I just throw it? I just threw a fucking glow stick, didn't I? Okay. Right, well, I'm not going to be here much longer. I feel like I'm going to just do one last thing, which involves killing this guy. Which went swimmingly. Uh, oh, shit. Um, there we go. You can't stop me. I am a master. Very nice. Uh, I think that is where we should end for now. Right, so. Clear barriers, it seems. Don't go down here. Don't go that way. Uh, we should be good. So, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna exit that, 
Alright. And then, just to end off, just as a fun little thing for Ashley, uh, I'll go into my uh, full on hard mode world. Alright. This is a world much nearer to the end of the game. Um, as you can see, I have the Crimson in this world, as opposed to the uh, the Corruption. It is very adamant about spreading. There isn't really much I can do to stop the spread, either. Uh, oh, did... I just got the, the kill every slime thing. What was that that just appeared then? Alright, nice. Um, okay, let's let's go let's go this way. No, actually I'm not gonna go into the dungeon just yet. I'm actually going to traverse my way back uh, through the through this area and into death. God. I actually wonder if Ashley's still even here. Doesn't matter, I'm gonna, gonna play around a bit in there. Uh, meteors do tend to fall from time to time. I can't tell if, um, Corruption? No, 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 that's, uh, that is most definitely, uh, hollow. Oh, nice! It's a hollowed crimson. Let's go in here, let's see what's in here. I've got sticky, uh, oh, no, 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 there's Belunker glow sticks, so they show you where all of the fancy ores are. Again, another benefit of playing the game for ages. He's coming to here, and oh my god, look, it's amazing. It's so cool. Oh man. Meanwhile, there's a there is a crimsoned. Uh, all right, so that there, there is there is crimson. It's just, it hasn't got the whole uh, continent yet. Well, that's good to hear. It's really refreshing. You either want deadly fairy tale land or. Uh, Deadly body parts land. Oh, there's there he is. There's the crimson. There's fucking spiders. So th this is part of why I really like the crimson. Um, it's the spiders. The spiders are great. As much as I hate the spiders, the spiders are great. Like, no joke, they are amazing. They are really good enemies. They'll, like, crawl up the walls to get to you. It's fucking horrifying. But that's what makes it good. You know? Okay, I remember. So I hollowed this part out. Because NPCs will not live in corrupted or crimson biomes. Right? But they will 
they're perfectly fine to live in the hollow. Oh, I remember this. Oh. Look at this. This is... This is a blast from the past for me. Oh, man. This is so nice. I remember this so well. It's bringing tears to my eyes. This th this world was where a lot of my uh, 1.3 uh, game like happened. Like, a lot of it. Okay. I've had memories. <laughs> Ooh, I remember. Hey. Ooh. Remember the, um... Remember the Terraria? Oh, I remember. That was an Eye of Cthulhu. Do you want to end the, um... Do you want to end the stream with, a, with an Eye of Cthulhu battle? That'll probably take, like, a few seconds. That sounds like fun. I'll wait for night time. In fact, I'll go do it in the crimson. That'll be even better. Hey, it's this place. See, this area is so low level for me now. It was a bit of a threat back when I first started hard mode. But now it's nothing to worry about. Now it's just kind of like, you know. That's just really piss easy. some time to kill before... Yeah, look. Look at those fucking things. They're horrifying. The worst thing is, you can get some of those appear, like... Right, so, so this, this was my uh, solution to um, getting rid of the Crimson. Just to build a wall around it. I was truly the Donald Trump of the Terraria world. I was just like, well, you know, if it's walled up, then I don't have to deal with it anymore. And so I walled it up, and there you go, I don't have to deal with it, you know? Pretty good. Oh, Hello, Floaty Gross. How you doing? What the fuck are you doing? Oh, okay, no, no, no. You're not to worry about. No, are you, actually? So, yeah, that's. Oh. Wait a second. Oh, that's not good. The wall doesn't work here, because the whole desert is just full of this shit. You see this? This is the only bit in this crimson area. Going to the desert. This will be fun. It's 
So a lot of these enemies in the desert are, are good fun to play against, I'll tell you what. Like these guys. Look how many enemies spawn in this place. I know I don't really need to worry about money or anything. Because I have... I have a lot of money. But, I don't know, it just... I feel compelled to get more. Can I use it yet? No, I can't. It'd be really great if there was some way to just instantly turn it night time. That would be pretty good. Is this one of those big ones? The big worms? Oh, nah, nah, it's not one of the big ones. It's one of the moderately sized ones, but not one of the big ones. There are fucking massive worms that can appear sometimes, and they will fuck your day up. They fuck your day right up. Royally. Okay. We will have to deal with uh, the desert in... Our area in, in our world as well. Should be fun to deal with. Oh, they are there, like that thing. Luckily, I'm too overpowered at this point for it to actually uh, affect me, but. Those things probably fucked me at first. Tell you what. Is there anything else in here I could use? I could use those. Gotta just get out of here. Please. The big one? I don't know. Is it going to be a big one? No. No, it's not fun. That's a big one. And that one's now dead. Oh, God. Oh, God. You see my health? <laughs> Good lord. I really don't want to be in combat for too much longer, to be honest. I'm going back to the surface. That we're close to midnight. That was a goblin scout. Nice. Fucking love the Magnus Spear. All of these weapons are so great. So good. Let's 
Go into the water. I was very low on health. I was so close to death. <clears throat> I thought, oh hey, maybe I can maybe I can just jump out of the top of the uh, the thing and it'll be fine, but no. No. There was no realistic way I was going to survive. Um so I was just like, yeah, no, I'm just going to jump out while I can, really. Gonna go into the dungeon real quick, just for a bit. I'll fight some some enemies, and then I'll kill the Eye of Cthulhu, and then that'll be the end of the stream. So get ready for the Cthulhu Eye to be destroyed. Oh no, spikes. right into the middle of the area. So this looks good. Dun -dun -dun. Is it about here? No, not here. It's a bit further down. So I know there are some areas in this place, right, which which are like hotbeds for enemies. They will just spawn and spawn and spawn and they will not stop. Here it is, here it is, here's the area. Bone Lee. Dead. Hell Armoured Bones. Dead. And here we are. Here's the... Oh my god. And there's the Eye of Cthulhu. It'll be fun, I'm sure he'll be a lot of challenge. Which will be extremely challenging, even. Oh. Okay, maybe he will be. <sighs> well, that was a waste. Doesn't really matter, I don't particularly use this world much anymore. Alright. That's it, that's the end of the stream, go home. Uh, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed yourself, and I will see you on Monday, where we'll be doing some more botanicular and try. So, see you then, in a bit.